gotta get you out of here. Come on, boy. The thing is, after that sack, this will be remembered like a good time. Put the man down, gentlemen. Is that the lot of them? I, I think so. Uh, so you're uh, alive. Allegedly. Well, don't worry. They won't be for much longer. Okay, go get them, Arthur. I can handle this. Don't worry about me. Deal with them. I think I heard something this way. Where the hell are they? Gentlemen, robbing thieves, it ain't no crime at all. Folk like this better work. Looks like there's law over the other side. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a hold up. Don't do nothing stupid. <laughs> Who do you? Okay. Now then, Martha, would you please have Senior Bank Manager here open up the... Hey, mister. Hello? Nice to get away from it all, ain't it? You okay, Arthur? Can't seem to escape idiots like you anywhere. You're going to be in a better place! Stay calm, breathe deep, and repent, or you will be moved to a better realm. Ladies and gentlemen, behold the calm removal of this man's existence. <laughs> Welcome back. Greetings.
Quite a view. Uh-huh. You know, this landscape, these views, this America, it holds us tight. And once we've seen it, we'll never know ignorance again. Maybe. It is that beauty, which really is the eternal beauty that is truth. This is God. Not the proof, but the thing. Not his work, but him. Wonderment is our morphine, I suppose. All us Americans dream of places. They are our God. I'm a terrible fraud, sir. Your friend was deceived. I am God's blithe plaything. And what a feeble game he has begun in me. My mentor never saw things quite like that. You know, I used to write in a study and teach at a university. I taught some Connecticut fops how best to appreciate their topiary. I was a gilded ape. I loathe the man I was. Man, I... Hey! Hey, you got a cigarette, mister? Maybe. Huh? I'm looking for a fellow named Angelo Bronte. Italian. I know him. Everyone knows him. Where is he? We'll take you to him. What it'll cost. I reckon I can pay. Five dollars. Where does he live? New York? I'm an entrepreneur. If you don't want to pay, then I don't want to walk. Oh, man. Some bad bread. Here. Come on. This away. Let's go, mister. You coming? Arthur. You familiar with the study of plants, my friend? Familiar ain't quite the word I'd use. Well, let me tell you. This great earth beneath our feet can provide everything man ever needs. But we've only reached a tiny bit of its potential. You see, there are thousands, maybe millions of plants all across this vast country we share. The mountains, the plains, the swamps. I mean to explore them all to know all of nature's bounty and all of her wonder, if I can. Sure. But I'm only one man. Would you consider helping me with gathering herbs for my studies? Why? Knowledge, kindness, beauty. Well, I'm ignorant, ugly, and nasty. <laughs> well, let's see if maybe we can do something about that. I'll see. Fire! Sir, no. Helen! Oh! Okay, I'll catch you later then. All right then.